Welcome to Upfront. Ako si Janina Chan. At ako si Martin Avier. At nagpapatuloy ngayon buwan ng wika. Di ba, Janina? This is yes. your favorite month. Your favorite month. Okay. Nating dalawa. Sige. Oh, bawal magiging Tagalog lahat <laughs> tayo. Kaya nagbabalik tayo dito sa loob ng Lakbay Museo. At syempre, last week nakasama na natin isang UAAP mm -hmm. queen. Ngayong week naman, certified volleyball lodi rin yung makakasama natin. At masaya to. Aha. Kasi kakapanalo lang nila Woo! ng PBL Championship yes, recently. Okay, huwag na natin patagalin pa. Let's welcome our guest co-host from the Petrogas Angels. Nandito si Jeanette Pangs Panaga! Yay! Palapakan! Oh. Noong Pilipinas! Ayan! Oh. Welcome! Pangs, welcome Hello. to Upfront! Ayan! Paano kayo nag-celebrate? Kasi first championship eh! Yeah! So special yeah. dapat yung celebration. <laughs> After the championship, uh, um, parang... Diretso ka agad kami sa, ma sa party eh. Wow! <laughs> party na agad eh. Very honest. Pwede na kami nag-celebrate lahat. Sobrang happy. Sana yes, pala ninvite ko kayo. Oh, <laughs> Congratulations. Pero thank grabe, you, iba talaga. You. Kung nasaan si Pangs, talagang may history na nagaganap. Laging may championship. I mean, nung sa NCAA, di ba? Mm. First ever title for the Lady Blazers. At for PBL naman, congratulations. First ever title para sa Petro Gas Angels. May ganun. <laughs> anyway, ano yung sekreto mo? Uh. Actually, there's no secret naman eh. Wow. Walang secret. <laughs> Walang secret talaga. Like, kasi, uh, lucky lang ako na nakakasama ko yung mga malalakas na team yes. and malalakas na players. So, wow. ayun. <laughs> kasi lakas mo lang. Yes. Oh, yun din. Oh, hindi na ako malakas. Hindi oh. mo, mo pwedeng sabihin, ah, lucky sila. <laughs> <laughs> oh, diba? Well, anyway, lucky kami dahil kasama mm -hmm. ka namin and I'm Thank sure magiging you. champion ka rin sa larangan ng hosting. Excited ka naman Excited din. Excited na ako dyan. Yes. Yes. Okay. Gusto ko pa try. So, let's start things off with our favorite sibling duo na I'm sure na miss ng lahat ng mga UAAP fans at balita ko Martin nakasama mo sila sa isang panibagong squad goals. That's right. Cheers to that at magpapagalingan sa paggawa ng Macfields ang champion at Ateneo siblings na sina Vince and Kat Tolentino. What is up, Upfront fans? We are here again at the Upper Deck to accomplish more squad goals here on the show. At ngayon, ang makakasama natin, UAAP Royalties. That's right. The both of them are Ateneo Eagles and both of them are UAAP Champions. Vince is actually in the MPBL right now playing for the Bataan Risers. At si Kat naglalaro ngayon kasalukuyan sa Premier Volleyball League. Kaya tara, kilalanin na natin silang dalawa. Nandito na tayo, kasama na natin ang Tolentino siblings. Welcome to Upfront, guys. Thank Welcome you, to Upfront. Thank you. And hi naman kayo sa Hello. UAP fans. I'm sure Hello. na miss nila kayo ngayon because we're not in the UAP anymore. Pero, syempre, a lot of the fans here, you know, would want to know a little bit more about you guys here. But how are you so far post UAP? You first, Vince? Um, me, I'm good. Uh, you know, just focusing on getting to the draft and. Uh, Playing in the MPBL right now, so it's good for me. But for you, Kat, um, how's post UAP for you? Um, it's been uh, actually pretty nice just because I'm done school also and I graduated. So okay. after the championship, and uh, my next step is to play pro, of course, <laughs> and I'll be looking to play in the PBL. Since a lot of fans would like to know here how you guys are like, uh, as siblings, are you guys competitive? Are you close? Because we always see you supporting each other. Uh, one thing for sure is that we're both really competitive. And, um, you know, although we're in different sports, we always uh -huh. talk about, you know, we need this. Like, we need to win. We need to find a way to win. We, you know, we just, it's just something, I guess, in our blood. So, how is that like? You first graduating with a championship, yep. and then... Her after that. <laughs> Season 80 was uh, when I won the championship, right? Yeah. And I was really hoping that she was going to get her championship. Uh, seeing him win the championship was kind of like inspiring for me as well because he brought back, I think it was the year you brought back the, the title. Yeah, yeah the first, it was the first yeah, one, right? First after after, first after one. a few times. And then yeah. this year was also when we, um, we brought back the title also. So it's um, just such a surreal championship. I mean, I couldn't have asked for a better way and I'm just thankful that there were no injuries or it was just a good season and that um, we were both able to end our Ateneo experience with the championship. Okay, since uh, you guys are both champions mm -hmm. and you're, you said it yourself, you're very competitive as siblings, <laughs> okay, are you ready for an off-the-court challenge here in the front? Yes. yes. Let's go! Okay. Oh. 
ito na magpapagalingan na ang uh, Tolentino siblings sa pagawa ng shake, pagawa ng kanilang special drink dito sa upfront. And Kat is a first year. Kat, uh, what's gonna be your special drink here? What are the um, ingredients that you're gonna be using? Well, I think I'll go for a more Philippine-inspired um, drink. Like, we'll start with the mangoes and okay. have that as the base of the drink so that really supports the, her inspired. Yeah, okay. the heritage of the Philippines. So we all know that it's known for mango. So, okay. Okay, so I'll maybe put one for, or two, maybe two, okay. so that it's super sweet. So I'll put a few bananas as wow. well, because everyone knows bananas go with everything. Uh, maybe some celery, so that okay. some, for the health conscious people. Oh, now sorry. it gets interesting. Yeah, let's put a cucumber, okay. just one. And then maybe, Two of um, carrots. Cats <laughs> for the color. I'll just put some apples to balance out the sweetness, so sweet and sour. Of course, lemon. I know lemon is to is used to help bring out the the flavor actually. It's okay. like salt for drinks. Lemon. Oh maybe I'll put okay. some lime also. Okay. It's like calamansi juice. <laughs> <laughs> of course I'll add a little bit of milk to make it creamy. Wow! <laughs> there you go. Oh yeah, and ice. I'll add some ice. Just a few more seconds so that the ice cr gets crushed. Okay. Oh my God, what would you call this drink? <laughs> um, I think I would call it the island um, mm. the island drink just because, of course, it's inspired by the Philippines and the main ingredient is mango, so enjoying the heat by the beach. There you go. <laughs> All right, it's time to make one more drink, and it's care of Vince Tolentino here. Vince, do you feel any pressure right now coming after Kat? <laughs> I do not feel any pressure. No pressure. Right okay. Um, but yeah, let's see what I can uh, whip up here. Let's go. Okay. okay. As Katrina had that mango-inspired drink, mm -hmm. I'm gonna go for a Hawaiian-inspired mm -hmm. drink. Uh, we will okay. start off with um, some pineapple. Uh -huh. So the entire the bowl entire of bowl, pineapple. We're just gonna throw it in there. Uh -huh. Put a splash of milk, you know, and then we're gonna throw in some cucumber. So right after pineapple, maybe we'll throw in some celery here. Okay. I'm not sure how that's gonna <laughs> go, but uh, and then one we, fruit. <laughs> And then we're gonna use the lime. Okay. This will really, uh, you know, bring out that that island taste. Apple, because we want to keep it consistent. You don't want to, you want to keep that sour flavor in the in the drink. So we throw in a few apples. Okay. Um, just just For to, the added just to add, yeah, just to okay. add that little uh, extra. And then we're gonna add a little more milk to get it uh, blended nicely. All right. The secret will be the honey, because uh, this will Kat be. Did not she did not honey. use the honey, but. Okay. I feel that this is a huge requirement. There you go. Boom. Okay, there we go. All right. So we're gonna pour it in here. Um, mm. And then, Creamy. to top it off, we're gonna yeah. throw in uh, three bananas. <laughs> <laughs> Just to spice it up a little bit. I call this drink the Hawaiian dream. The Hawaiian dream. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so it's time for the much awaited peace test. Titik man yun nila yung mga ginawan yun nilang drinks. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it has um, a very uh, interesting taste. His is really, the, you can really taste the pineapple, and I think it really reminds me of the beach. So we have to have a neutral person here, si Sir Nino from TUD Sports Bar here. Hi. Sir Nino, hello. <laughs> Para takagang nalunod ka doon sa ninyo. Ah, okay. Ito naman yung kay Kat. Mango yung ginamit niyang bis. Galing nito kung kumate ni Sir. Yung mga reaction niya, hindi mo mabase. Sir Nino, you've tasted both drinks already. Who's the winner, Vince or Kat? Vince being the banana-based and Kat, mango-based. Para sa akin. Yung ginawa nila. Grabe si Sir Nino, no? Thank you. Sir Nino, may pag-asa ka sa showbiz. Hindi, <laughs> joke. <laughs> Joke lang, sir. It's a tie for the Tolentino Sips. How do you feel about that? Tie? 
Happy. Uh, <laughs> she's happy, happy, but Vince? I'm not sure about that. <laughs> <laughs> and that's another squad goal accomplished here on the show. Watch out for more of your favorite athletes right here on Upfront. Cheers! Cheers! Cheers.